Hey everyone, welcome back to the Dark Souls 3 walkthrough lore through series. This is episode 41 and we are about to face the final boss of the DLC for the Ashes of Ariandel. Let's hope I can do it. <laughs> so I put one point up into uh, stamina. Um, there will be a summon sign right here for Gale. We're going to want to bring him in. Gale will come at the second phase of the boss fight. We're going to throw on Tears of Denial. That's Father Ariandel. Is only the same quiver with misguided. He's about my life. Oh boy, <laughs> this is going to be a tough boss fight. I can snuff out his ashes. Yeesh. Oh man, how did that hit me it was insane. And then this is her BS where she's invisible. Oh, how she got me there is crazy. Dang it. Phase one down. Gale should come and distract her and fails two. We're going to focus on Father Ariandel. Because it will be both of them fighting us. That heal right away. Mm -hmm. 
Now he's going mad. It's easier to beat him because he's slow and you can actually stay behind him or close to him and he won't hit you too hard and he'll miss you actually a lot. And the flame brings her back to life to fight us. Um, so we're going to focus on that. Hopefully we can get this heal off. There's Gail. Now, perfect. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm frostbit. Ugh. This is stupid. Ugh. There you go. I believe she was healing him. It should be our Titanite slab, and then we should fight her next phase. Yeah. You can backstab her, and that's what I was trying to do. Oh. No! There you go. Whew. Almost, I almost died there, but we got the soul of Sister Elfried. That's the way to the new DLC, or the last DLC, the Ring City. But we are done here. Or we leave. Go level up and read all the lore for the items that we got. Especially in the last episode as well, because I forgot to do Wilhelm's set. Yeah, Gale makes the second phase way easier. And the third phase, to be honest with you, because she focuses on him. And he lasted a pretty long while. I was surprised. Didn't have to use... I forgot we had Tears of Denial as well. So she's up here painting. Let's talk to her.
Instead of the home that Elfried manipulated Father Adrian Dell to maintain, which is why the Corvians, some of them supported them and some of them didn't. Um, let's go to. And this was actually a cool DLC. I like D this DLC better than the Ring City. Um, but that's just me. <laughs> and we'll save the Ring City for the next one. This is going to be a pretty short video. Um, I did not think I would beat her first try, but let's, uh, Yuria is going to have some interesting dialogue because we just beat her sister. We got a couple of things. We've got the Rose of Ariandel, the soul of Sister Freed. A flail used by the bulbous father of the painted world shred his own skin, producing blood to appease the flame. Both a weapon and a miracle catalyst. Ariandel, the restorer of the painted world, knew it and painted the world with blood. Only, and only blood would protect the secret. So Ariandel is the girl that's painting the painting. Now we have Freed, uh, a great sight wielded by Sister Elfried with a curved blade, thinly coated painted world frost that easily breaks the guard shields in the painting, and scythe as a symbol of a long lost home, possibly explaining Elfried's preference of it. So, um, oh, I've got the stats too. That's all, just get that. Now let's talk to Yuria before we end the episode. Be safe. Interesting dialogue with her. Kind of even more lore for Elfried. I think this is the last one we gotta buy from her. Giving us anything. Let's see if we have any more him. Oh, we bought everything from him, right? Yeah, we got everything. All right, and we've ended the episode. Or we're, I'm going to end the episode here, and we'll start the Ring DLC in the next one. Um, let's, okay. Forgot, let me read the armor for Vilm at Vilhelm. Black armor of Vil Vilhelm, knight of Londor, and nice fit for any lean hollow. This hollow knight who served the three sisters who founded the Sable Church was particularly lo loyalist to the eldest. So she was the eldest, uh, Elfrida, and who was known as Cold-Blooded Hangman. Um, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. And we'll continue with the Ring City DLC in the next one. Take care.